What's going on guys? Welcome back to Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. So uh, in the last part we got to Morbill City. We got a pretty chill team. So I'm gonna go down this way and pick up an HM, I'm pretty sure this guy gives us. Maybe people call me the Rock Smash guy, but I find that sort of degrading. I think I deserve a bit more respect, like maybe the Rock Smash dude. Woohoo! Anyways, your Pokemon look pretty strong. I like that. Here, take this hidden machine. I don't get how people always say that in the in the Pokemon world. They always say, your Pokemon seem really strong. It's like, how can you tell? They're in their Pokeballs. You don't even know what Pokemon I have. Anyway, so I got Rock Smash off that guy, which is like a horrible move in this game, but whatever. This item is an X Speed, which is really, really useless. Uh, and then we can go up this way, and we can actually, pretty sure we can get a bike off this guy. Well, well, what have we here? Most energetic customer. Me? You may call me Rydal. I'm the owner of this cycle shop. Your running shoes, they're awfully filthy. Did you come from far away? Sure, yeah. Mm-hmm. You're saying you came all this way from Little Root? My goodness, that's ridiculously far. If you have one of my bikes, you can go anywhere easily while feeling the gentle caress of the wind. I'll tell you what, I'll give you a bike. Oh, wait a second, I forgot to say, there are two kinds of bikes. That bike, and, uh, yeah, but I've, oh, this is so long. <sighs> Basically, I'll just get a bike. Woohoo, got a bike, because I'm awesome. Obviously. And uh, if you can't tell, I am actually a little bit ill right now, so I might sound a little bit strange, but, oh well, I'm going to keep uh, keep recording. And Wally's over here. Alright, he's chilling. Uh, Alright, I'm going to leave with Broloom, because if the game is consistent, and he still has his Remoraid that he caught earlier, he'll still have it, so that's cool. Don't you think you're pushing it to suddenly challenge him? I'm not pushing it. If I fight with Remoraid, we can beat anyone. I reckon I've gotten a lot stronger. Yeah, we please have a battle. Okay. So this guy's trying to take on the Morville Gym with a Remoraid. That is ambitious. A level 16 Remoraid. Very ambitious. Anyway, I can Mega Drain that thing to the face. And he has Lock on. Alright. Don't know what he wants to do next turn, but whatever. Is he even going to have a next turn after this Mega Drain? No. <laughs> One hit kill. See you later, Remoraid. Thank you for coming. So I defeated Wally. That was pretty easy. He doesn't say anything, then he just says, I lost. No shit. Well done. Fucking idiot. I'll go back to Verdant Turf. Rykwin, thank you. Being a trainer is tough, isn't it? It's not just about it's not just to have Pokemon and make the battle. That is what being a real trainer is about. Well you don't need to be so down on yourself. Why was keeping you from becoming stronger and stronger? Come on, let's go. Home. Everyone's waiting for you. Yeah, you might want to catch some more Pokemon at some point, Wally. You know, just having one is probably not the greatest idea. Whatever. Um. Anywho. Oh fuck off, this fucking guy. Jesus Christ! I was watching that match. You're friends with that boy, Wally, aren't you? Didn't hold anything back and beat him impressively. So a real Pokemon battle is all about. I idolize trainers like that. I idolize people with no remorse. Apparently. All right. So I'm actually going to go this way, which is uh, a new route, so I can actually catch. Uh, a new Pokemon on this route, so let's see what we find over here, and let's battle this guy first. I'm in the middle of a triathlon, but whatever, let's have a battle. Well, he's obviously in last place, because he doesn't care about winning, you know. He's just chilling at the back, he's like, fuck it, might as well have a bit of a break. I'm not going to lose any places or anything. Also, I don't know if it's the greatest idea to be doing a triathlon and running up and down. You might want to be, you know, going to a certain destination. Probably the idea. Maybe towards the finish line. Maybe. Anywho. Here's for the glare. Gets the paralysis on Broloom. Mm, that's alright, I guess. Come on, you bastard. I'm just gonna keep Mega Draining this thing. It's doing. Oh, critical hit. Thank you, Broloom. Very nice. Go for another one. I don't need to sneeze. I'm going to cut this out of the audio though. Ah, oh, excuse me. Jesus. That is awful. Um, another Mega Drain should kill this thing. He's going for the rage. That's fine. That's no big deal. But I get the Paralyze, of course. Come on. He's just going to keep raging. That's fine. Awesome. And that dance boss is dead. Woo! Alright. Rudolph's still getting that experience, it's always nice. Oh, fuck! I have to register this guy. I have no interest in registering anyone. Alright. Rudolph is level 17. 
get him a few more levels, then I'll switch to switch to Miles. Right, let's uh, let's get in this grass and let's see what we can catch. Should be uh, interesting. What we got? It's a Numel. I can dig that. I can dig that. Broloom is not the best matchup though, so I'm going to switch into probably into Tinkerbell just in case he has like magnitude or some shit like that. Don't want him to fuck over my Rhyhorn. But yeah. I'm going to get the Intimidate on that new move. So he goes for the Growl. That's fine with me. Go for, uh, go for a Lick on this thing, see how much that does. That does pretty much nothing. If I can do like one or two more. Oh, of course he gets the bird. Fuck's sake. If I can do like one or two more and hopefully maybe get the paralysis, that'd be nice. Oh, of course my attack is fucking down now as well, so it's doing even less. Come on, get the paralysis, Jesus Christ. Come on. Come on, one more fucking thing should do it. Oh, Jesus. Well, Tinkerbell's dying, so... Holy shit, he lived that with two. Did not think it was going to be that close. Fucking hell. Right, let's go into Juggernaut. I'm going to make the assumption that he doesn't have magnitude. Cool, so let's start chucking some balls at this thing. First time, thank you very much. Data was added to the Pokedex. Num Pokemon. A, a Numel, 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 Numel. Stores boiling rag in the hump on its back. It is a hardy Pokemon that can transport a 220 pound load. It has served humans at weren't since long ago. So it's a slave, pretty much. I'm going to name you Yes. What should I name you? Mm, I'm going to name you Etna. Just because why the hell not? Is that another female? We, go. we have a full team. Holy shit, we have a full team, guys. I have six Pokemon in my team. Who knew? Jesus. I'm going to go heal up quickly, and then we're going to check out this new Numo. That is a tongue twister. Alright, so let's check out this, uh, this new mall, this Etna. It has Oblivious, it's a bashful nature. It has a Rawsberry, cool. It has Growl, Tackle, and Ember. Guess that's chill, I guess. That's, that's pretty cool. I can dig it, I can dig it. But now we actually have a Grass, a Water, and a Fire Pokemon. Apart from the fact that that Water Pokemon is kind of useless right now, that's, uh, that's besides the point. Anywho, um, so what I'm actually going to do is switch Juggernaut in front and leave it, leave the uh, EXP show on Rudolph for now, just for a couple more levels, and then I'll put it back. Um, so let's go do some battles on this route. There's quite a few I seem to remember. There's a daycare here, which I won't be using, and um, we've got a double battle here. Gonna tag up with my super senior student partner and beat you. I doubt it. Hopefully. Alright, so senior and junior Anna and Meg have a Meganium and a Manectric. Jesus. That's pretty cool. Juggernaut's not liking this uh, this matchup, so uh, I'm gonna switch him out, go into Tinkerbell. And Broloom can. Mega Drain the Manectric. Alright, so Tinkerbell comes out, gets the Intimidate on both of them. Awesome. And Magic goes for the Tackle, that shouldn't do too much. Critical Hit does not very much, that's fine. The Aiden goes for the Rest when it has full HP, Jesus. I'm going to try and get rid of the Manectric first then, so I don't waste any... Uh, 
any time on this Meganium who's just going to rest. They learned Mega Drain, fair. Goes for the rest again with full health, so that's fine, just wasting turns. I can deal with that. Mega Drain should kill this Manectric. And it does, awesome. So now they can both team up against this Meganium. Gaining that experience, Rudolph grows to level 18, awesome. Let's go for the tackle on this thing, and let's tackle that as well. Ah, oh, why you gotta reflect like that? Really? Ah. Oh. Alright, I'll go for the bite instead then. I'll go for the sun spawn on this thing. Of course it goes for the rest. Oh, fucking hell. This could take a while. Bite is a decent amount. Stun Spore fails because he's sleeping. Keep going for the tackle then. Waste and turns until that reflect wears off. He has Snore. What the fuck? Doesn't do shit, but still. What the fuck? Come on. I almost kill it. Go on, tackle. Yes. Kill that Megadium, guys. Awesome. I'm sorry, Anna. I let you down. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. Why do I have to register so many fucking people? Jesus Christ. I don't particularly need to heal up, so let's carry on. What's up, bro? Listen, could I get you to battle the Pokemon I'm raising? Sure. So look at this dude in a sweet overall. Pokemon breeder Isaac. And he has a Zubat. Juggernaut likes Zubats. Because he can rock tomb them to the face. Boom. Come on. Boom. One hit kill. No big. Not very much experience of that though, but whatever. Victory Bell. Definitely gonna switch. We're gonna take a victory bell. Oh, let's try Edna. Yeah, why not? All right, level eleven. So goes for the razor leaf. Hopefully, it doesn't do too much. No, it doesn't do that much. That's fine. Ember does a lot more than half. Nice. You know, one more should do it. He goes for the sweet scent. That's yeah. Who gives a shit about Sweet Scent? Honestly. And Ember is going to kill that Victory Bell. Very nice. Apom. Uh, let's. What's Rudolph got in terms of moves? Hard Attack on Rock Throw and Block. That is pretty awful, if I'm honest. Um. You know what, let's stay in with Etna. Why not? Let's just see how it goes. All these guys are like level 11 anyway, so... Should be able to take him. Sand attack. Fuck you. Cool. Should be... Should be three hits. Maybe four. Open three. Another Ember gets it down. That's... Uh, I don't know. Scratch does. Holy shit! Critical hit! Fuck you, Apom! Jesus Christ, it's going down to 2 HP. Next is the Dust Girl. Well, I'm switching. Um, let's go into Tinkerbell. You can bite that thing in the face. Jesus Christ, Critical hit gets me down to 2 HP. Damn! That was very close. Hey, Scott. Oh, Scott's long lost relative. I'm gonna kill you. And yeah, that, that, that's that's a dead little Scott relative right there. Next is a slack off. No problem for. Let's try Rudolph. See how see how he fares. Alright, so this uh, suck off's just chilling. Let's go for a rock throw on that thing. That is a lot. That's very nice from Rudolph. I need to sneeze again. So, excuse me. 
Sneezing is not the one. Jesus Christ. So we kill that slack off. Rudolph goes to level 19. It's awesome. So uh, it's going to bring up Mareep. Um, if only I had a ground move on Etna. Um, no one's taken a Mareep. Juggernaut can take on a Mareep. Alright, so out come, comes this uh, little electric sheep. And I'm going to rock tomb that thing. See how much that does. That's a one hit kill. Nice one, Juggernaut. Again, not very much experience, but we beat Breeder Isaac, so that's pretty cool. Like that. Let me guess, we have to register. Yep, fucking hell. Jesus Christ. So many registrations. So I'm going to go back and heal up because Etna's hurting a little bit. Be back in a second. And we're back guys, so I'm just going to um, take the EXP share off Rudolph and I'm going to give it to Etna. Because Miles, I don't know, Miles is not really my, my favourite in my team right now. I'm going to give it to Etna and see if I can get him up into a camera up, that'd be very nice. I do my triathlon training with Pokemon, so I'm pretty confident about my speed. You don't need speed in a triathlon. It's a long ass race. She has a Cypher. That is perfect for my boy Juggernaut. Rock Tomb is going to kill that thing, pretty damn certain. Sweet. It's cool getting a bit of experience with that. Etna grows to level 15. And we defeat the Triathlete Maria. No, for fuck's sake, another fucking registration. Jesus Christ. Alright, holy shit, so many trainers along here. Um, let's stay as we are. What's up, bro? Once a bug catcher, and now a bug maniac, but my, my love for Pokemon remains unchanged. Sure. Whatever, bro. So, bug maniac Derek has a houndu. Because that makes sense. Go for a rock tomb with that thing. So he goes for the ember. It's cool, does a little bit, not too much. But he gets the burn. Fuck you, Houndoom. That doesn't even do shit with the fucking burn anymore. Damn it! Alright, I'm gonna have to switch off his burn damage. Let's go into. Let's go into Rudolph. See if we can rock through this thing. He goes for the smog, that's fun with me. As long as he doesn't get the poison, that'll be nice. He doesn't get the poison. Awesome. He goes for the layer. I can deal with that. Rock throw, see how much this does. And that's a one hit kill. Very nice. Rudolph. Awesome. Dragon upgrade to level 20. Next is an Onyx. Looks like a job for Broloom. Alright, so this looks like a bit of a beast. Level 16. Mega Drain that thing after he goes for the Screech. Ow! Your sound waves hurt me. Anyway, Mega Drain's gonna hurt this thing a lot, and that is a one hit kill with a critical hit. I don't think it mattered, but still, critical hit. And uh, yeah, Alex is dead. Awesome. Which means we defeated Bug Maniac Derek, who had no bugs. Alright, um, I'm just going to keep going this way because I can't mess about people. And there's another trainer here. Allow me to evaluate if you have raised your Pokemon properly. Of course I've raised my Pokemon properly, bitch. There's a Geodude. Tits, I forgot Juggernaut was burn. Oh well, I'm going to switch into Broloom again. He goes for the mud sport. Go for the mega drain on this thing. That's a one hit kill, no problem. The 
The Geodude fainted. Awesome. Etna's getting that uh, experience. Next is a Sparrow. Going to Rudolph, we can rock through that thing. He's going to hit the Sparrow with a rock throw after he goes for the Growl. And that's going to kill that Sparrow, no problem. And it goes to level 16. Pretty chill. Next is a War Tortle. So I'm going to switch back into Broloom for this one. I'm going to Mega Drain that thing. That does a lot. Almost a one hit kill. He goes for the withdrawal. I can deal with that. It's no problem. And another Mega Drain is going to kill that thing. Awesome. Alright, so we're in Verdant Turf Town, but I don't think there's much to do here, so... In fact, tell you what, I'm gonna... I'm gonna end the part here, guys, and next part, hopefully some more exciting stuff will happen. We'll go back, maybe take on the gym leader next episode, so I will see you next time. Peace.